Hello guys, welcome on Tesla Adventures. In this video, we are going to discuss the details uh, of mixture of gases. So first of all, uh, we we discuss the case A in which we have to derive the expression for the value of CP mixture, CV mixture and gamma mixture for a mixture of gases which are mixed at same temperature. So let us derive this expression for two gases. Let us suppose that this is gas A and gas A has a temperature of T. The number of moles are N1 and the uh, gamma or, or the degree of freedom is F1. And uh, gas B has the temperature T number of moles n2 degree of freedom f2 okay now now uh, if we mix these two gases then obviously you can see that the heat will not flow because their temperature is same and if we will mix these two gases then we can say that the mixture internal energy or the internal energy of the mixture will be the sum of internal energies of the two gases and therefore u mixture uh, can be written as n1 plus n2 where n1 plus n2 is the number of moles of the mixture and we know that u is n uh, cv into t so n cv mixture into temperature will remain same because no heat exchange would occur because temperature is same so the temperature of mixture will also be same. Now U1 will be equal to N1 F1 R into T by 2 plus U2 will be equal to N2 F2 R into T by 2. So we can say that CV mixture will be equal to N1 F1 R by 2 plus n2 f2 r by 2 divided by n1 plus n2 and uh, we know that f1 r by 2 is cv so cv mixture will be equal to n1 cv1 plus n2 cv2 upon n1 plus n2 so this is the expression for uh, the CV mixture now let us find out the CP mixture so we know that CP is equal to CV plus R and this expression also holds for mixtures also so CP will be equal to CV mixture or CP mixture will be equal to CV mixture plus R and CV mixture is N1 CV1 so CP mixture will be equal to N1 CV1 plus N2 CV2 upon N1 plus N2 plus R. So CP mixture will be equal to N1 CV1 plus N1 R plus N2 CV2 plus N2 R divided by n1 plus n2 and cp mixture will be equal to n1 cv1 plus r plus n2 cv2 plus r divided by n1 plus n2 and hence we can say that cp mixture will be equal to n1 cp1 plus n2 cp2 divided by n1 plus n2 this is the formula for cp mixture now let us see the gamma mixture now gamma mixture is cp mixture upon cv mixture and uh, by dividing these two you can see that it would be n1 cp1 plus n2 cp2 divided by n1 cv1 plus n2 cv2 this is the expression for gamma mixture 
now this uh, is the case a and we now discuss the case b in the case b when we mix two or more gases at uh, the different temperatures so let us assume that there is a gas a which is having n1 moles and uh, the gas a is having f1 degree of freedom and the temperature of the gas is t1 and gas B is having N2 moles, the degrees of freedom is F2 and temperature is T2. So when we mix these two gases, then obviously uh, the heat will flow from higher temperature to lower temperature till the temperature of the mixture becomes saturate and the temperature of the gases will become same. And this is also very obvious that these gas, gases are uh, not interconvertible or they are not reactable with each other. So we can say that again uh, we know that the heat given by a gas will be absorbed by the another gas and therefore we can say that the internal energy of the system will remain constant because heat is transferred within the system from one gas to another gas and hence we can say that delta u a plus delta u b which is the change in internal energy of the system will be zero and therefore it can be applied for n number of gases also so for n number of gases you can apply delta u1 plus delta u2 up to delta un and that is equal to zero but for two gases we are applying this formula and hence we can see that u is n cv t so delta u will be n1 cv is f1 r by 2 and if the mixture temperature is t mixture then delta t is t mixture minus t1 plus uh, this is n2 f2 r by 2 and this is t mixture minus t2 and that is equal to 0 so by uh, rearranging the terms we can find out the t mixture and t mixture will be equal to n1 f1 t1 plus n2 f2 t2 divided by n1 plus in fact divided by n1 f1 plus n2 f2 this is the formula for mixture of uh, the temperature of the mixture when uh, the two gases are mixed at different temperatures okay so in the next video i'll be bringing some more concepts of thermodynamics thank you